All right, Shalom, Shalom. All right, first and foremost, before we get started, we like to start off by giving all praise and honor and glory to, to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashim, Ba'ashim, Got the brothers here with me, you know, the beloved brothers, man, you know, uh, you kind of acquired the brother Parai behind the camera and the brother uh, Makai, man, you know, just with a quick epistle, basically a reminder of you to be sober and watch for the times we're coming into, man. But uh, you got it, brother? It's First Peter 5 and 8, be sober. Be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walk up about seeking whom he may devour. Mm-hmm. And hey, that's what you have, man. And especially, you know, just let's just speak on a spiritual level. You know, Satan. You see, uh, brothers daily are, are battling. You know, that spiritual demon, Satan, man. You see, but this the time to be sober. You know, to be vigilant. You about to shout? You get that word sober? Come, I got this word for sober. G thirty five twenty five, mm -hmm. and they say to be sober, to be calm and collected in spirit, mm. to be temperate, this passionate, circumspect. What it said to be collected in spirit. Mm -hmm. See, this the time where you really want to be collected in spirit. You want to be calm. Now, I mean, you want to be at one with your how about some y'all shy, man. Uh. You see, because we coming into some heavy times, man. And again, hey, it said the adversary. Uh, what is the adversary of the devil? Mm -hmm. uh, Russell paraphrasing, you know, walking about seeking who he made to buy. Hey, Satan, he's coming hard, man. You know, what the scripture said for we are um, yes, we wrestle. Yes, yes. bring that this out. Ephesians 6 and 12, it says, For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, mm -hmm. but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world. Yep. Against spiritual wickedness in high places. Yep, against spiritual wickedness in high places. So it's a spiritual battle, man. It's a fight that we're constantly at, man. Every day you wake up, you, you're going to be fighting, man, constantly, man. Over and over and over and over and over, man. But see, Satan, he's coming to see who he may divide, man. That's his main job, to take you out this truth, man. Throw you down, man. You know? But it it all goes back to you, whether or not is you going to, you know what I mean? You're going to keep fighting. No, I mean, you gonna you gonna put your sword down, you know, or, or is you gonna give up, man? You know, cause in this thing we supposed to what constantly examine ourselves, you know, and set ourselves right, man. You see, because again, it, it starts with us, man. You know, Lord said He gonna start at His house first, man. You see, what you had some up? Yeah, I got a quick one, but I would say, um, you know, um, what it said, be calm and collected. Mm -hmm. You know, they're going into long suffering. Mm -hmm. You know, and like you said, Satan, you know, the spirit, man, you, you, we got to consider Job. You know yep. how Satan tested Job. Hey, so like, if I'm at Pariah, you got something? Uh, yeah. Okay, uh, bring that out for, uh, go on, you get your preacher up for one of y'all brothers, Bible shop, y'all can give me that book of James. This okay. Luke. Yeah, so like, go ahead. Come, come. This Luke 21 36. Watch ye therefore and pray always that ye may be accounted worthy to escape all these things that shall come to pass and to stand. Before the Son of Man, you know, so all these things are gonna to come to pass, and you know, Satan gonna teach you. Hey, you gotta, you gotta pay attention, man. Be yep. calm and collected in the spirit. Whatever yep. the Lord send your way. Yep. You can't be drunken from these other doctrines as well, man. Mm -hmm. You see, you gotta be in one doctrine, man. And hey, like we brother paraphrase, one spirit, one mind. Mm -hmm. You see, you can't be that. Hey, that's a perfect way of being sold. You know, not drinking these other fucking philosophies, man. And shit like that, but you uh, you got that. Okay, you got it. Just going based off back with the brother was talking about, you know, when you come to temptation and stuff, you got it, bro. But it's James 1 and 2. It says, my brethren, count it all a joy when you fall into diverse temptations. Yep. Knowing this, that the trying of your faith work in patience. Mm. But let patience have her perfect work. Yep. That ye may be perfect in entire Wanting nothing. Yep. Now get that in the NLT. I got it in the uh, NLT. It says, Dear brothers and sisters, mm -hmm. when troubles come your way, consider it an opportunity for great joy. Yep. Consider an opportunity for great joy because what? The Lord chastises those who he loves. You know, rough paraphrase. You got it. For you know that when your faith is tested, yep. your endurance have a chance to, to grow. grow. Your endurance has a chance to grow. Lord is sharpening you up, man. Mm -hmm. You see? And he, he warned you these things, and we ain't going to get it, but, you know, Sirach, uh, what is that? Sirach 2 and on. Uh, 
I'm oh, you are. Oh, right. Right. Got it. You got it. That's <laughs> Iraq. Please ask us two and one. It says, my son, if thou come to serve the Lord, prepare thy soul for temptation. Yep. Set thy heart aright and mm -hmm. constantly endure. Yep, that's it. Constantly endure. The Lord is, he, so he let you know, when you come into the house, prepare your soul for temptation, man. Get ready to battle, man. Especially, again, these spiritual, you know, demons out here, man. You know what I mean? It's not an easy fight, man. You know, like the elders, the elders and apostles say, man, hey, know what you're getting yourself into, man. You see? Because you're constantly going to be at war within the mind, man. You know? The, hey, Satan is going to be trying to you know, take you out of this thing, man. Which we know who Satan worked for, ultimately. Who? How about